The Paddle Out by Mark Chasson. In life, we're often called upon to overcome challenges and do things we don't enjoy, especially when we are seeking to fulfill big goals. When I am called upon to do things I find difficult or challenging, I often use a surfing analogy to remind myself that I'm just paddling out. It's part of surfing and that if I continue paddling, I will make it past the break and get the joy of surfing amazing waves. The paddle out is the part of surfing that makes us stronger, expands our lungs, strengthens our muscles, and increases our courage. If you want to surf the waves, you've got to paddle out. Sometimes nature cooperates by giving you a lull between the waves or a current that easily carries you out. Other times the waves keep pounding you, tossing you around and pushing you back. Wisdom and skill are gained from learning such things as when to dive under, go over, or go around the way, and learning when to let go, relax, and conserve air. Even though it may be challenging, don't quit. Be tenacious. Keep paddling. Your hard work will be rewarded as you increase your strength, endurance, and wisdom by overcoming challenges. You will soon be surfing the waves of your dreams and experiencing the stoke of dancing with the waves and the forces of nature. Just like seizing opportunities and fulfilling your goals in life, each wave represents an opportunity and requires three fundamental things, position, timing, and skill. To successfully surf your wave necessitates being in the right position at the peak of the wave paddling to gain speed to match the speed of the wave, standing up at the right time, and having the skill and wisdom to read and surf the wave. The skill and wisdom result from consistently surfing, making mistakes, and learning. When you are faced with challenges, obstacles, or doing things that are difficult, to achieve your goals, just realize you're just paddling out and will soon be joyfully surfing the waves of opportunity in your life.